Captain, good evening. And what was the protocol follow when the boat was allowed to enter our port? Buenas noches. Eh, el protocolo... Good evening. The protocol required for the entry of the boat to San Andres is the one that was established ever since we did it together with the Health Secretariat and the other entities that are part of the Port Health Committee. The procedure that we established as a result of the health emergency by COVID-19 is that first I will make a visit aboard the ship to verify the conditions to see if any of the crew members could have or not some symptom that we have already known from the COVID-19 contagion. After this visit, the other entities which verify the boats and allow free entry to the group will make the visit after the authorization and approval of the Secretary of Health. This is how it has been done during all this time and this is what was done with the boat Susuro when it first entered San Andres on April 20th and then when it returned from Old Providence on May 4th. Captain, have the crew members been tested before? How to guarantee that they were not infected and why were they allowing trans to the port? Para el primer arribo de la marca. The first time the vessel arrived on April 27th, the vessel informed through the established maritime traffic information systems that they were going to arrive. The visit and arrival was made by the health secretariat and then with the port captain. Already after going to Old Providence and setting sail for Old Providence, the shipping agent informed us that there was a medical situation on the ship that a crew member was sick, so the ship was returning to San Andres. And when the ship arrived at San Andres and the shipping station asked him why he was returning, the answer was they had a sick crew member. After having anchored in the almond trees and when the visit was attempted in the health secretariat, the ship informed us that it had a dead man aboard. Then the information that the captain offered regarding the condition of the crew member was not true and it was this situation that led us to the situation that we now have. Did the crew member show any symptoms at the time of the inspection? Than a sick crew member, as I stated at the beginning, it is easier to get him down in that area and not on the outer area of anchorage. 